I know freedom is fresh. It's precious. Freedom is precious, you know. Lewis Taylor is savoring his first 24 hours of freedom. We sat down for a face-to-face -face interview with Taylor and his attorney, Ed Novak. His freedom is new. His emotions are raw. You know, I did 41 years of my life, you know, for something I didn't do. It was shameful. It was shameful what they did to me. There's a lot of life that you missed being in prison. Yeah, I don't even know how to drive a car. It ain't supposed to happen in America, you know. Supposed to have the best justice system in the world. How did I fall into cracks for 42 years? He's free, he says, because the Arizona Justice Project and 60 Minutes uncovered evidence of a shoddy investigation, suppression of evidence, and racial bias. The world knows I'm innocent. They should know I'm innocent. I am innocent. No contrast. Yesterday, Taylor pled no contest to 28 counts of murder and was immediately released. Proving his innocence would have required another trial. The Pima County prosecutor says his release doesn't mean exoneration. His conviction still stands. Why not go forward with another trial and completely clear his We name? would have done that, but the Pima County Attorney's Office said that they would fight the petition for post-conviction relief all the way to the Supreme Court it would have meant another two, three, four years of incarceration for Lewis. You know, I didn't want to go against my principles, but I didn't have no choice. How should I give him another, another minute, another hour, another decade in prison for something I didn't do? You know, I, I, wanted, I wanted my freedom. In 1970, on the night of the Pioneer Hotel fire, 16-year-old Lewis Taylor was helping people escape. You were considered a hero that night. Yeah, but they changed it all because they cut on my skin. <laughs> you know, I hate to say that, you know, especially... <laughs> it was the little colored boy, the Negro boy. They, and they singled me out. How does that happen in America? And we're supposed to have one of the best justice systems in the world. Can somebody explain that to me? Nobody can explain that to me. Taylor says he intends to spend the rest of his days just living and doing good things. Bill Whitaker, CBS News, Phoenix.